Okay, I'm talking about the voice to parliament and the upcoming referendum. And this is a question that came through. So it says, my question is, why are there a whole lot of no's and a whole lot of yeses? Who do I listen to? First of all, thank you for this question. Now, the reason there's a whole lot of no's and a whole lot of yeses is because the Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander community is made up of individual people. We don't all think the same. Um, and even though we might have the same goals, so self-determination is a goal that we all have in our community. Yet we don't always agree that there are the same steps to put in place to get and reach those goals. And this is an example of that. This is one way of reaching that goal and it's not something, um, it's not a stepping stone that all people think is the way to go. Um, and the thing is, it's absolutely okay for us to not agree on these things. This is why we have these powerful discussions and this is why we share how it's going to impact our communities and why we have these conversations. Now, in terms of who do you listen to? It's very vitally important that you own your vote. I encourage you to follow your own moral compass and vote in a way which aligns with the moral compass that you have. Because as a result of your vote, the impacts that happen following the vote, you need to own that for yourself. Um, and not go, well, I listened to this group and that's why I voted this way and therefore this is the reason these impacts are happening. Every single voter needs to totally own their vote and go, I'm voting in this way. I own this vote. Um, though it is wonderful, it is uh, a great practice, a good practice, an ethical practice to listen to Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander voices on this matter because it is something that impacts our community directly. So you can do the listening and then with that, follow what your moral compass tells you to do. I hope this has been helpful. And if you have any more questions about the voice to parliament, please pop them in the comments.